All right, guys, welcome back. It's car wash Saturday. I need to clean the wife's vehicle. It's been outside, it's been raining, it's very dirty. And I'm gonna use three different products uh, today. I've used them before, pretty good products. We're gonna try them again today. We've got Nanolex products. So we're gonna use the pre-wash foam. This is a mildly alkaline solution, anywhere from one to four to one to eight. So we're gonna take that, we're gonna put that into our foam cannon here. Now I'm using 100 milliliters. I've got 500 milliliters of water. So I got 100 milliliters of this product here. All right. After that, we're gonna use reactivating shampoo. Now this is a shampoo that uh, supposed to have bonding agents to your vehicle, to your other protection on there, leave extra hydrophobics. And this one you use one to 200. So I've got about a little less than a gallon of water here. I'm gonna add some of this inside here, maybe about a, an ounce and a half. And then I'm gonna hit it with the pressure washer to foam it up again. So here's my half ounce. Actually, that was that was two ounces right there. So I lied, we're using two ounces, I guess. Um, and then after we're done washing the vehicle, we're gonna go ahead and dry it. We're gonna use SI spray, which is a sealant of theirs. And you know, of course you wanna apply these sealants to clayed and polished vehicles. This vehicle's got a coating on it. It's got protection. We're just gonna use it, top it off and let it go. So make sure you hit that like and subscribe. I hope you enjoy the video. Let's go. I'm gonna show you the car, how dirty it is, and then we're gonna get it going. All right, so like I said, it has been raining and it doesn't rain often, so when it does, all the dirt just kicks up everywhere, all over the vehicle. It is full, full of dirt stuck to it. So I'm just gonna show you around a little bit here. You can see how dirty this is. And we're gonna get going. Okay, so I've got my Nanolex pre-foam wash. It's not a whole lot, so I'm gonna do a quick run around with the spray here. We're gonna foam it up. You don't wanna really let this dry in the sun. Uh, it is probably about 96 degrees already. So I'm gonna do this pretty fast. All right, as you can see, we've got some nice thick foam here. It's clinging very nicely to the vehicle. Looks good. It's breaking down that dirt and debris. And let it sit just a little bit longer and then we're gonna rinse. All right, so let me take you in close. After the pre-foam wash, you can see there is no more dirt on this car. I mean, that's pretty dang good. We're looking at all the lower panels here. Very nice. That stuff really works well, especially on coated and protected vehicles. Very happy with that. Just gets all that grime and everything off there so that you're washing on a safer surface. All right, I've got my reactive shampoo. I'm gonna foam it up. All right, so with this reactive shampoo, 
it's supposed to add hydrophobics. I don't suppose we're gonna see that too much on here since this car is coated and always, always hydrophobic. But we're gonna put it on there anyway and just top it off. Yeah, I'm gonna do one side of the car at a time. So I've already got this washed. I'm gonna rinse it. Okay, so we finished doing the pre-foam wash. It took a lot of the dirt off. We did the hand wash with the reactive shampoo and it looks very hydrophobic. Now, I'm not sure how much is added to it or not, but I'm gonna show you what it looks like. All right, guys, we've got the SI spray, and basically all we gotta do is get two or three sprays on it. All right, well, I was rudely interrupted, and basically, like I said, all you do is spray a couple sprays onto the towel, you wipe it in, it goes on a little, oily but as you wipe it in it levels itself and you just kind of buff it off it's a very nice easy product to work with very nice let's see uh can you guys see that it just wants to fall the towel is moving Now let me see how this feels. So the hood feels fantastic. Now it's got the reactive shampoo on there, so I would expect it to feel really nice. And as I get over here, it's just buttery, silky smooth. So fantastic, I love it. Okay, now let me attempt to show you how this flashes off up close. One, two, three, there's three sprays onto the towel. Let me wipe it in here. Now, can you see it's oily? Can you guys see that? So I'm gonna wipe it all over. And as you keep wiping, the oil kind of evaporates off. It's pretty nifty. And then you just flip over and buff clean. It's that, that easy. Oh my gosh, that's just awesome. Love it. So clean afterward. No streaks, no residue.
All right, guys, if you liked the video, if you did hit that like and subscribe button. Today, we're talking about the Nanolex products. We started with the pre-wash foam. The car was dirty. We foamed this up at about one to five, sprayed it on, went around, that's 500 milliliters of total product that I made in the foam cannon. Sprayed it around fast, because that's not a lot of product. And, you know, I didn't let it sit maybe a minute, because it's hot outside, rinsed it off, I would say all the dirt was gone that I could see with my visible eye. So really nice foaming product there. Did a great job at removing the debris. Came back over it with the reactive shampoo. I mixed it at about two ounces to a gallon right there. I just did a uh, hand wash. I washed all the car, half a car at a time, side to side, and then the front and the back. Uh, I rinsed them as I went along. And you know, the car is always hydrophobic, but this didn't stop it at all. If anything, it made it even more hydrophobic. The beads were nice, small, tight, big bead angles, and uh, looks fantastic, okay? This also made it feel slick. So decently slick after just using this product. Very easy products to use to get your car clean and topped or even protected. Now, after drying, I went over it with a towel, I blue dry it as well, dried some more, and we took the SI spray. Sprayed that into another towel, two to three sprays per panel basically. Wiped it in, flipped the towel over, wiped it off. Mad slickness, excellent gloss, super easy product to use. Now, I've had this for a while and I've really never given it a shot, but I mean, it just goes on so easy. I went around the car so fast, it buffs off real easy. Feels good, looks good. Nice, nice product. Um, as a triple combo right here, you guys, I would say very effective and fast, friendly, easy to use, and the results are fantastic. Now on the wheels, I didn't scrub the wheels, I just pre-foamed them and rinsed them. I did use the Auto Fanatic Hyper Gloss diluted one to one, and I just sprayed that around. I did kind of a waterless wash. This Hyper Gloss, does have some fantastic finishing look to it. Deepens and makes a, a glossier look. The wheels are matte, but you can see the nice shine to it. And at one-to-one, -one, it did a fantastic job. So guys, that's my review of these products or usage of them. I've used them before in the past and I'm just using them again, coming back around and really enjoyable this time. Absolutely loved it. It's, it's over a hundred degrees now. I'm sweating like crazy. Hope you guys liked the video. We'll see you later.